Matteo is going to join us here, as Peter mentioned earlier on. Matteo has recently joined the team. He's going to tell us more about himself, joining the team, how we find the team itself. He's enjoying around here. <laughs> how are you, brother? Good, good man. I am as, right, as you can hear, we were talking about yourself being joining us here yeah. at the camp. Are you enjoying around with us here? How do you find actually around the camp? Because you've been not out so much. You, you're always around the camp. You can explain more about uh, that. I think uh, it's a pleasure to be around uh, this area. And uh, I also would like to say that, you know, this is one of the places that I thought I would never come to. And uh, it has been interesting, you know. I've only been here since Tuesday. Wonderful people. And I've met uh, welcomed and unwelcomed visitors. Especially the red uh, that always visit the year around. And uh, uh, although I haven't seen many animals, uh, I would be doing that very soon. Uh, mostly in final control. Making sure that we deliver the pictures as people see it out there. Uh, but uh, nevertheless, I'm very happy. I'm very happy to have met Alex behind the scene over there. Uh, I don't know if the audience has actually seen him. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm very happy to be here as well. Thanks, Matteo. Can you tell the audience what's your position with us here on Waldef? What are you going to do? Uh, actually, are you the presenter? Are you the cameraman? Are you the director? Something like more about that. Well. Uh, that's a very tricky question. I would not want to be a presenter. You know, I am more comfortable behind the scene more than anything else. But uh, I think my role in 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 this uh, brilliant concept, which is live content to to the masses out there in the world live, is I, I just would like to play a, play a part in it. You know, whether that part means me being in final control or whether it means me being behind the scene or whether it's me being writing a blog but uh, some of my responsibilities here are writing you know present not no not presenting <laughs> writing uh, being in final control right uh, directing uh, and and who knows some somewhere in the future i may have to cut somewhere like i'm doing now <laughs> that's true i mean Mateo, as we I mean, all people that might know you from the blog already, you have post one of the blog already, or you're still going to write more? Uh, I'm hoping to do that regular, uh, regularly. Uh, there is a couple of uh, writings that will be coming up uh, either tomorrow or tomorrow or in the, second, uh, in the second day, but I will be doing a lot of writing. I also would like to interact with a lot of audiences out there just to begin to see exactly like that on, on what, we, what we bring them, you know, I think it's very important. I also believe that there's new audiences that are coming along, you know what I mean? We getting different people from anywhere, you know, and I, and I think it's very important that we take the message out there and we need to interact with these people that, that we, 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 we have caught, we have come, uh, we, we have been accustomed to. Thank you so much, Mateo. Can you tell us more, I mean, the audience, and the show from, you know, something like that? Okay. Uh, I am Mateo Selik. Yeah, I was born uh, in 1979. I don't know if I should put that to show me how old I am. <laughs> but I was born in 1979 in Maputo, uh, Mozambique, uh, in uh, Eduardo Montani Hospital. I uh, came to South Africa in 1981 with uh, my parents. Uh, funny enough, my parents are Shangan. Uh, Shangan speaking, I've not had an opportunity to actually practice the language and understand it. You know, I grew up in Kimberley, uh, where the largest man-made hole is. Uh, yeah, basically grew, I, was, I grew up in Kimberley. Uh, um, I was much of a city boy more than anything. I only got to hear about Shangan when families come, you know. Uh, we used to have this big gathering, gatherings at home, you know. When family come, I could hear people and what. The, you know, <laughs> but I'm sure I'll be learning, I'll be keeping up, you know, it is in my blood, it is in my genes. Uh, give me a couple of days and I'll speak Shangan. And Alex will help me as well behind the camera. <laughs> it's very, it's very, very amazing, very fascinating. As Mateo is a Shangan, I'm the Shangan, he can speak to one as himself. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's more common, I mean, as world changing, as Shangan is getting diluted, you find people going all over. A part of the world, but I really appreciate it. Because Mateo is tend to be open, tell us he's from Maputo, Mozambique, he's born there, and he's coming back here. So really, 
Master Richard Matero, you're very much welcome as we did welcome you before here. So while I watch yourself for <coughs> around chat around the fire, if you have anything else to tell the audio Matero, you're very much welcome before we close down the show. Uh, well, I, I just would like to say uh, I'm happy to be here, you know. I'm great. Bring uh, images of wildlife and, and people who live amongst these communities uh, in a whole new perspective. Uh, that is why I'm here, and that's why I hope what I hope to bring to the people out there. And uh, I hope to learn Shangan in a couple of days, and I've got great tutors who will be helping me. Uh, you, Brad X, uh, we've got Alex over there, we've got everyone else who will do that, yeah. Uh, and I'm happy to be here. Thank you so much. He yeah. word. He said he's going to learn Shangan and so on and so on. From a South Africa, I just want to thank you very much for everyone that joined us, chat around the fire for the afternoon. I really appreciate it for your time to be with us. Until we get to see you next Sunday, we'll be around here. Maybe Alex will come here for a next time. But I know he's very, very shy. Thank you so much. Enjoy the rest of the afternoon. See us tomorrow morning, as Peter says, 6, 6.30 Central Africa time. We'll be again large, big head of the buffalo that really is amazing to see around here. Goodbye. Enjoy. <laughs>